Mr. Jace. Nate. How are you? Back at it, man. Good, yes, sir. We got a little latte in here. Coffee it up with Michael. There you go. We're going out hack our, our Texas broker here. Comes from, came from San Antonio today. He's going to do a speech at uh, 1 o'clock. Yeah, whatever they say. My name is Nate. I'm going to say your name. There you go. Myself. Some of you guys know this, some of you maybe don't know this, but one of our big, like, monstrous uh, things that we follow as far as, far as PAC is concerned from a leadership perspective uh, is, is something that's, that's very near and dear to us because it really governs. A lot of you guys hear about our principles, you hear about, you know, let's go back to the values, go back to the values. Well, that's a, it's a key set of values that we've... Uh, that we doesn't happen overnight. I'll, I'll be the first one to tell you guys it does not happen overnight. However, in time, we always draw back to in certain decision making uh, things with the company. We draw back to them, right? And so um, I've got a, a little uh, small, really small gift for uh, for a few people that are here right now that have you know taken that leap of faith, have been with us now as leaders for uh, you know a good amount of time, a year, something along those lines, and and are now you know we're we're all kind of seeing the fruits of what has transpired as a result of those decisions. Uh, and so this is the first time we're doing doing something like this in a out of pack meetup. However, I look forward to doing this more in the future. Uh, so, you know, I've got a, a couple of gifts for a few of you. The first one is a gentleman that uh, I've known for quite some time and um, you know, really when, when Gustavo and I were talking originally, it was like, what do we, like, Texas, like, we want to do it, we want to do it, how do we do it, how do we do it? And uh, there was that there was that piece there that was missing that was the, the broker, right? That's, the, that's kind of a, a big piece there. Um, and when that piece presented itself, it, it, it all flowed, it all made sense, and, and I, don't, I don't honestly think we could have drafted up somebody more ideal. So with that, I'm going to be handing this to Mr. Michael Guerrero. Uh, this this next individual, we, we all should know by now, and if we don't, then, you know, just look at the tall, beautiful person with the long hair. <laughs> But, you know, so, so proud of this guy, man, Gustavo. He's been absolutely amazing. Uh, you know, it, 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 yeah, it, it's interesting because I think the horse is one of the things that I, I was kind of just downloading as a result of just, you know, watching all of us on our horses was that the horse really was a reflection of, of us, right? And, you know, one thing I love about Gustavo and his horse was they were like, <laughs> you know, they're, let's go, let's go, let's go. And, and since, like, literally day one of friggin', you know, you guys are going to see it today. I mean, I don't know. You know, we'll see what the what it's like, but I'll tell you, it's it's, a, it's as a reflection of, of him saying, "Let's go, let's go," and, and being very proactive with, with moving the, the needle forward and, and ultimately changing a lot of lives. So, thank you for that. Yeah, absolutely. This, this next individual is actually one of the first people that I talked to about PAC and uh, was pretty cool because we were bouncing ideas off of each other. We were really thinking, drumming, and and, uh, and he was just like, you know what? Like, I'm in. Like, let's just go. Uh, and since then, he's been monumental in adding components to the company that I think a lot of us appreciate around our CRM systems and ultimately just being an amazing connector, man. I mean, just, just being a, a light, bringing a different side of, of pack to the world as well. Um, and so, just so happy that he's here, Mr. Francisco. Oh, thank you. Yeah. And then this individual is just, he's just amazing. Uh, I'm, I'm glad that he's here and he's, uh, you know, I'm glad that he was able to be here because he was just on a, a like a three month long hiatus and I missed him a lot. Uh, but we did some really, you know, we've done some amazing work in Arkansas and there's 
just so many people being blessed out there. It is, it's, you know, it's just, it's, it's a blessing to see it really is. Um, I think that this will just help impact that, that much more for this. Okay, Mark. All right, team, and again, you know, this will, we'll, this is a very small token, it's a very special moment, but uh, these, you know, these individuals have laid a lot of the groundwork, I'm telling you, a lot of the groundwork for even this to transpire, so um, as, you know, we all continue to develop, the book is actually called The Collaborative Way, um, some of you may have heard of it before, some of you maybe have not, but I'll tell you, this is a book that will absolutely change your leadership life, your organization's life, because it talks about principles that are very, very valuable, so. That being said, let's have a great happy meeting. Random odd number you possibly can because it makes it, it establishes a sense of assertion and dominance. So it's like, all right, in real estate, for example, right? You're making an offer. All right, we're going to counter. This price is a million dollars. We're going to counter at 896, 334. I thought you were getting the bottle. I thought you were getting the bottle. By the way, I haven't, are, like, really I, I haven't shared another thing. I've been doing a little bit. One more. thing we started in, in uh, Arkansas is a uh, is a after the pack meetup. We find a cigar in my office. So, that's, that's what Jason was on. That's on the back of the itinerary. Yeah, nice. <laughs> In terms of growing with the pack, I mean, it's it's what this is right here. Like, we're together. The culture, the vibe, makes you want to get up and work, get, and keep doing it at a high level, and keep doing it with people that you love, and that you seeing grow into who they are as business people today. But it's more than just business. It's a lifestyle. It's about family. It's like growing with the right people, like. The people that keep coming, that that's being scaled on, it's it's more of the more of that same mindset. So it's more people that you actually just get along with and, and want to grow with. And as a result, that's that's it's a pack. You know, the name is kind of suits it. You know, it's it's the it's, it's a group of individuals that are coming together to do what we do best, but at at scale. Yeah, they, they want to see you win and you want to see that win, right? Exactly. Since then, everybody was just kind of like, obviously independent companies taking a coaching program. Now with PAC, it's coaching, but it's a real estate company. And instead of being in separate companies, now we're all coming together. Right. It's not too bad, but you would hope it would be cold for two. I mean, how it looks, right? And then, uh, and then, well, and then Michael's here too. So, I mean, you have some. I have, things? yeah, I have a, an SUV. Okay. Six people, I think. Okay, cool. And then, so, and I'll get a, I'll get a large Uber. So, if you guys just want to, let's just plan on meeting here, like 12, 12, 40. Is that cool? About 40 minutes, 45 minutes. All right, let's do it. 12, 40 down here.
deeper in brokerage, but hey, it doesn't matter because we help each other. Collaboration is key for success. So thank you so much for being here. My name is Leo Hidalgo. <laughs> Listen, how many people here are, you know, one, two years in real estate? Right, got it, okay. How many three to five years in real estate? That messy middle part, that messy middle part, right? Okay, 10 years, 15 years in real estate? Four? Gee, everything is at the feet. You got a phone, you got a cell phone there? You want to, go ahead, I bet you can you jump on, it's not right now, you can jump on Zoom and get in the training right now. It's about transferring energy and enthusiasm to the person you're looking to get this thing to a perspective. Pre-qualification and presentation of the more you practice, the luckier you get, right? You know what you do, excellence is an awesome habit, right? There, there are uh, people out there that highly skilled person, right? All of you, are, are you guys great human beings? Yes. Every decision I make, it comes for a place of servitude. I'm like, I want to be like 10 minutes late. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> So Packham Realty has impacted my life in a few different ways. And you know, I'll tell you the, the first way is it has allowed me to think at a lot bigger level, right? And so, you know, in real estate, a lot of people think that you have to make a commission, spend the money, make another commission, spend the money, make another commission. Pack Home Realty is showing people how to have residual income over a long period of time. Right, so it's like, oh, Bob Smith down the street. Dude. How quickly do you just write off clients as opposed to really having that empathy and asking those additional questions? That's beautiful. Um, recently, many of you have seen the identity shift that is Pack Home Realty. We're going to discuss that a little bit. Or are we just... Yeah, it's making sense. Okay, good. All right, good, good. Uh, so, and then, so to see that number... There you go, my friend. You You're so welcome, brother. Thank you, yeah, absolutely, man. Yes. We have this individual right here. Uh, I'm on a conversation with him. these similarities, and when you're involved in it, you feel more like you're in I am versus in shadow. And that's the ultimate goal for each and every one of your lives. Everybody has a system. Hey, so I'm Carlos here in Houston, Texas. We have a team. Uh, the way PAC has uh, impacted my business is that it takes care of all the training from my agents. We literally role play every day. We have even a, um, a meditation session every Tuesday. Like, what? <laughs> uh, and that um, translates to all my clients and better helping them. Um, I know how to negotiate better just because the scripts, the role plays, and that leads to more deals and more money, right? So I, I love PAC and I think it's, um, it's a very amazing opportunity. And if you're not in PAC just yet, like, what are you doing? <laughs> uh, we all are super happy to collaborate with everybody. Uh, if you ask me a question, ask a question. Um, we're all super happy just to guide us if we don't know it or we don't you know how to get there, and you know help our business, right? Help each other, bounce ideas, and yeah. Pack Home Realty is much more than a broker. We have a community of incredible people, people from all over the United States. Tenemos coaches e instructores donde podemos tener clases todos los días y podemos practicar las habilidades para atender a nuestros clientes de una mejor manera. Eso es lo que realmente me gusta de PAC, el hecho de que podemos practicar a diario y mejorar nuestras habilidades. Y no solo eso, no solo ser un mejor Rialto, pero también poder mejorar como personas, como seres humanos. Y es por eso que elegí entrar a PAC. This is something that I implemented with PAC, you know, having a routine where I know exactly what to do during the day. 
uh, getting to prospect, doing cold call, doing social media, and getting straight to the pond. This is something that have changed my life. Uh, before joining the pack, I was only doing five to 10 transactions. Now, this is the first year with Pack Home Realty, and I was able to close 30 transactions in this 2023. And wow, that was a life changing for me, and not only for myself, but also for my family. So I'm very grateful with Pack Home Realty. Also, something that I like is the support that we can have. We have different access to platforms like Slack. We have a CRM, Chain, KB Core, and of course, having the training daily role play so where we have the opportunity to practice in our skills. Um, being with PAC, I look forward to being a part of a community, all of the trainings that are offered. Um, there is a lot of learning that we can do. There is trainings all the time going on every single morning. We have role plays, so I really just look forward to the way I'm going to grow. And and the community that has such a great mindset of just like growing and being powerful and everything. So I really look forward to being a part of PAC. So the, the so the question is just like what is the what's what was your takeaway what did you I don't know learn uh, maybe not even learn just from today specifically the C pick up on anything yeah whatever what, what made an impact what made an impact very good. This one specifically, I would say uh, having the realization that we're 
literally opening up everywhere and just all the new people. Like, I just met so many new people today. And you know what's funny is like, we, um, I, I was trying to be very intentional about like, you know, having some guests because I got a lot, of, a lot of friends out in Texas and everything. And uh, like, I was stuck in the ballet. And he's like, yeah, I was telling you. Oh, I heard about that. I just, I, I went up to the ballet and he's like, he's like, yeah, so it's a real estate event? I was like, yeah. And he's like, I take my test next month. And he's like, who, who, what company should I go with? I thought it was like some sort of just training or whatever. I just went to my shirt. I was like, pack. And I was like, give me, give me your information. I'll, I'll hook you up. This and that. With it. And it was just funny. I just feel like the culture is uh, attracting everybody and everybody. That is my big thing. It's like we're everywhere now. I'm sitting in Houston, Texas. This is my second time of year. You know. The ballet guy goes in and looks already on the drip campaign. He just hit that LV ad. He's on my one o'clock phone. He's like, Elevate Ab's got its own pack funnel. He's going to get hit from everywhere. John, how about yourself? Takeaway is, you know, I. You know, when we're starting this thing, there was only a few of us. And I realized that a lot more of us. And like it falls right in with the who not how and the collaborative way and see new faces that light up when we, you know, when we bring this in like new cities and there's a uh, there's an inspiration to it all. You know? And you see people's eyes light up and you see the nods and the smiles and they get and you start like we 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 see it, and they and they start seeing the people. And I realized what we bring to the real estate community, or you know, especially our guests, they start seeing it too, right? And this group is getting not just bigger by number. The fact that we can go grow in numbers with the quality, and everyone, the driving force is that we. All together, we're going towards a, like a very same place, and in terms of that push, is really inspiring. That's where it's going. And people are getting inspired and motivated, and, so it just, and then it brings back the inspiration of as to why you even we're doing this. Yeah, it just, I don't know, it's a beautiful place. Yeah. I feel like people's eyes light up when they see like. Almost like what a lot of different companies are missing that we kind of help, like we put it all together because there's so many of us. Yeah. Like Colton and I were just talking about like his background and his expertise and what he does, yeah. and then what I've done like these last two years with like that and like Anthony, what you've done for the last decade, bro. Like John, like I feel like all of us together, we all just bring like you know, all of us. It's a melting pot of ideas and like perspectives, and nobody is. Not one idea or perspective is better than the other, and nobody is trying to compete with one another on my ideas better because of blah blah. blah right? It's like that's fucking dope. Yeah. <laughs> like that is dope. And this, and like let's make a baby out of it. <laughs> we were sitting at breakfast just a few weeks ago, and uh, one of the agents who she she had literally just signed up, not even transferred her license to Cecilia. Oh my gosh, that was a, she's up, she's off. Dude, she's, 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 she's gonna be amazing. She's, no, she's amazing. And she's we're talking about like 72 Soul, we're Jason, or Jason yeah. South. We're talking about 72 Soul, we're talking about uh, Soul 65, like these listing programs, right? We're like, why don't we just make a listing program for Pack? So literally right there at breakfast, we come up with listing Pack, we hash out the details, and it's something that we're all gonna be able to use. Like, just because we've got all of this stuff from everywhere else. Yeah. You know, um, I just really resonated with what uh, Jose was saying, how fast this thing is growing and how organically, like really it hasn't been ridiculously complicated. Like it's growing in a very cool, organic way and people are naturally gravitating towards it. And just by sharing even brief moments on social media from the pack meetups and stuff like that, people ask questions and like I see it at home having conversations with just like people that are like nothing's like, what is that you guys are doing? Like what is it? What is it? And then it's growing and growing and growing and the fact that it's been a year, I, like they can think about it, it's freaking mind blowing. 
you know, it's a year, and it's 240 agents, and seven or eight different states with a bunch of others coming already, and it, it's, it's wild, you know, and to have the, that mode of like, hey, all of the leaders are going to Arkansas and going to freaking Colorado and coming to Texas and moving around. Like, that's a, because really, like, everybody could just be like, hey, no, you, like, that's your territory. You handle it. Yeah. You know, yeah. that's your shit. You do your thing. I'm going to still focus on me. That's so true. But no, everybody's like, fuck, let's go. Yeah, it's so true. You it's know, not, it's not fractionalized. It's not like fractionalized. No, that. no, no. It's, yeah. like, it's, it's like, hey, let's fucking support it. Because the more, the faster we grow it, state by state by state by state, the faster all of us grow as well as individuals. Because it's easier, especially with the with social media and how this thing grows and everything, you're going to be able to attract people from everywhere in the country. Then Canada. Yeah. You know the world. The world. Yeah. 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 Right. Yeah. So it's going to be it's going to be (laughs) epic. And, and here's the thing, this is, it's it's truly exponential, exponential, because not only because of the way it's built as a structure, as a business, with the revenue share model and everything, but also because of the momentum that it's gaining, and that as people see, it's like, hold on, what? Eight states in one year? Hold on, who? What? Like, people, in the, like, it's, it's beautiful. And that was like a big thing for me, like, I was sitting there, I was like, damn. There's a hundred fucking people here, <laughs> you know. I remember yeah. talking to you in the airport, you remember? and I was like, yeah. "Oh, bro, no, 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 like, bo, 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 bo." You're and you're like, "Yeah, yeah, yeah, okay, cool, cool." And it's like that yeah. was like there was zero. Yeah, <laughs> like, yeah. 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 It's fucking sick. Wow. Can I can I ask you what what um what inspired Founders Pack in one zero zero one? Because as much as we talk about not fractionalizing, yeah. just the structure and of that. That empowers us to all work together because we yeah. can be a part of something bigger that comes from the company, not just from our productions. Yeah. Well, with with uh, with with founders pack was I, both all of it stems from just partnerships, from just partnerships. And I just I just firmly believe that. <clears throat> okay, so I'll tell you where it comes. So for year for ten years at. Uh, the previous company that I was with, it was really all, all that I wanted. It was all that I wanted was to, to be in that position, right? And I, and I felt like I more than earned that, right? And that's what I feel like for everybody. So you just want to partnership with everybody that you're in business with? Absolutely. And then, and then also, I mean, you know, you have to look at the John and Jason and stuff like this picture. John and Jason was like, when, you know, we, we didn't, the model is not built for like, like salary, you know, it's not, it's not built for that. So it's really built for, you gotta have faith. Like you gotta, you gotta go out there and put the work in it. You gotta d- develop and you gotta believe in people. We gotta develop leaders and we gotta help people and assist and like, I mean that's 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 really that's really what it is, you know. Is this is a, you know, most companies are, are opposite, right? I'm gonna go pay a manager, you know, X amount of dollars, and then they're gonna go out and do, you know. But I, I, but I also believe in percentages. I believe in the power of percentages over base, fixed, in, you know, salary type of deal. And I, and I believe that with the power of percentages, we can all become wealthy beyond our dreams with the power of percentages. Um, all right, we're, so we got who was Francisco? Who was who was to the? Jose. Yeah, Jose.
said again earlier we're sitting out there I think there's to get a human to move in, in a direction I think there's three levels it starts with motivation right motivation is like let's get somebody excited but motivation is temporary and I think there's inspiration it's like okay I, I want to be like that it sounds great awesome and the third level I think that's kind of when you're really kind of more, more or less self-actualizing, more aspirational. That's like the great people, right? That's the, that's the MLKs of the world and the people that really cause you to like a movement to happen, right? And to me, this group is aspirational. I get around this group and I feel so, not just inspired, but like I want to run through a wall, you know, with, with this group of people. Like, it, you guys make me not just feel better, but be better, and want to bring other people along in you know, this journey with us as well, and cause them to be better. And I, I think that's the power of this community, right? Like I've shared the story with, with a lot of you guys. It's been a, a rough, you know, kind of ride for the last year, two years, whatever, and it feels so good to be here. Like the the joy. Smiles, the laugh, the fulfillment. It just feels like oh, and uh, that's what it is. I mean, you know, just, this guy right here, like I'm, I'm around his energy and his presence, and like I'm like, I'm just I'm happy to be with you, man. Like I'm genuinely happy to be around you and, and everybody else here. And like it's right, you know, I, I love every one of you, and it's you know some of you I just met. And I love you guys too, and I'm, I'm excited for what you're doing. Um, and you know. The more that we can not just motivate other people, but cause them to be inspired and aspire to be part of this movement as well, the bigger this is going to grow, the more it's going to come down, and the more power that you know this, this movement is going to have behind it. So for me, it's just every single one of you is the biggest takeaway I've had. So I appreciate all you guys. I really do. <laughs> I know, like, this, this, is, this is all I want in the video right here, that's what you're talking about. <laughs> uh, I don't know, for me, I just like community and family, and I feel like we're just one big family. So it's great to get together with everybody and build something. Uh, <laughs> one thing that she said, she's like, when it was, when it was my decision making time, and she's like, Supporting you through this, supporting us through this, she goes, Where are you going to feel that? And I thought that was like, Yeah, yeah she's like, You can be in this big, you know, bubble, whatever, but this feels right, right? This feels like family. So I thought that was really good. I want to thank everyone, but first, baby, I'm so proud of you. Everything have accomplished all your growth it's so amazing to see you right there and sharing all the light and your inspiration and your motivation and your good intention your good heart and that excites me too so um, i'm super proud of you uh, it feels great to be around all of you um, and like i told you Anthony, like i was wearing the pack for the first time, I feel like it feels right. It feels like I'm home, and it feels good. So thank you, thank you, all of you. Oh, sorry, great to be here. <laughs> so yeah, thank you, thank you for coming to Houston, all the way from all the states coming, um, and that we had a great event. So I'm happy, I'm happy, and this is just the beginning. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for hosting us. You guys are so much. Like, this is, you know, like, this is awesome. And the whole, the whole team, like, I was sharing, like, well, I'll share my eyes with my kids. I'm having to get it.
we hosting the event, we got together, and then Leo and then Carlos, the teamwork of, you know, us here, you know, getting together and, you know, wanting to put something together to, to bring, to bring value, right, for the movie. And so the teamwork of, of us here and then all of us together combined. And then the second war is a uh, connector. Being the connector of like connecting my community, you guys, with our local community. And being that connect being that connector. Uh, a lot of people know you guys through what I share on my social media. And so I know we had a lot of the guests who were like so excited to like meet you guys. And, and, and to, to be that bridge, that connection, that was that was great. So those, those are the two words, teamwork, connection, and again, just like Annie was saying, uh, super grateful for you guys. Uh, thank you for your support, thank you for being here. I just love it, I love it. Yeah. Um, I want to share, first of all, an observation. Right now that we're reading uh, uh, Sam Walton, Made in America, one of the things that Sam Walton would do is he would go to his uh, merchant partners and he would ask them a bunch of questions uh, so that he could figure out which way uh, would be a better way to, for him to do business, right? And so, listening to the book, uh, I believe it took anywhere between three to five years for him to open up his first eight stores. And to think that we are, how many states now? Yes. We're in Arkansas, California, Colorado, we're South Carolina, we're gonna be in Nevada soon. In, in just a year, the exponential amount of growth that we've had is, has been amazing. And what's beautiful is that the founding members are not having to go out, right, seeking for, uh, different ways of doing business we're all uniting as one here and we're brainstorming and sharing ideas and I know I'm learning a lot uh, so that's one of the biggest observations that I've, that I've noticed from all of this is that we can all unite as one and bounce ideas and grow from each other and we're not in the competitor mindset we're not in an envious mindset I think I've shared this before uh, we're, we're all united as one so we're learning from one another and then my biggest takeaway is uh, being in this seat surrounded by all of you guys, which thank you for the opportunity, right? Uh, to allow me to say where I am today is that what you guys have accomplished is possible for my family and I. What you guys have accomplished is possible for the agents that are waiting for me to tell them about this experience back at home, right? That we're not we're not any different from one another and instead we're only a reflection of each other and we're brothers and sisters hanging out uh, and sharing these ideas so I think that's been my biggest takeaway is that I'm about to change my family dynamic forever and ever and ever for generations that's been my biggest thing, uh, takeaway and, and thank you Every single one of you uh, for allowing me that space. Clap for all you guys. I want to clap for all you guys. <laughs> Everything and the 
fuel to the connection, the energy, and what I saw, the people, you know, like, is that energy? I, I told myself, okay, I can have 40 people very quick, very quick. Yeah. So, thank you everybody for coming to Houston, and I, I feel very happy as to see all the faces again. The guy's waiting on where's my car at there? <laughs> So uh, it was funny, we were talking, we were having a full conversation on the way over here, right? We did a, uh, what do you call it, karaoke, car, car karaoke, <laughs> we, 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 talked, we talked a lot, but you know, uh, there's something that, that we talked about before and you know, there's a need for a certain thing in real estate and that certain thing is what Pack Home Realty has. You know, it, it's giving back to the real estate agent. It's really caring about the real estate agent. Caring, just like you, you just said, there's no competition. There really isn't. We just want to see everybody grow. And that is really the bottom line. We want to see every, everybody grow. And uh, I, I don't know who I was talking to earlier, but I just said, look, look at, okay, let's do it now. Look at everybody that's here. Do you feel threatened by anybody that's here? Besides John's cats? Yeah. <laughs> that, that's a whole other story. That's a whole other story. <laughs> you don't have to flex him, John, but all right. Nobody feels threatened about anybody that's in, in you know, this circle right now. And and I'm talking about anybody that was in the presentation and at the whole the whole pack meetup today. There's, I didn't feel threatened by And everybody that is with us at Paco Realty, it just feels so good. I've been around... I think longer than anybody in this room. I've been in the business for over 25 years. I'm going to stop saying 26, 27. I'm just over 25 years. <laughs> and this is very, like, you may or may not know. However, this is very, very unique. And it's very special because there's so many... I mean, I'll say it, there's so many egos in this business, right? And the ego is completely gone from, from what we're doing. And I think that, you know, that's a testament to, to Anthony, first of all. You know, and, and Anthony, when, you know, we had a, our, some of our first conversations with you and John, it's like, there's no room for that in what we're, we're doing. First of all, it'll cripple what we're doing and, and we don't want to do that 
We want to grow to these levels that, you know, nobody's grown that fast and that big and that wide and, and with that many good people. And I just, like today, I, I, I took a step back and I just looked at everybody that was there and it was pouring rain, right? Loud ass cars and trucks going by. Microphone wasn't working. You know, and and I sat back and you know when I was talking when you you went up to me and you're like, I'm sorry, I'm like, it was perfect. It's perfect. Yeah. It was perfect. perfect. There was there wasn't anybody in the crowd was going, Oh my god, I can't hear him, you know. There was just like, all right, cool. Yeah. You know, make it fun, whatever everybody's like. And so I mean you know, to 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 get to the point, you know, we just have such a great crowd. I'm just so proud to be part of what we're doing. I'm, I'm proud to be amongst everybody that's here. A couple, couple things that come to mind. You know, first and foremost, Savo, Ani, thank you guys so much for hosting us. Marjorie, here in your guys' city. Carlos, uh, I mean, it's, it's uh, you know, I, I, I think I shared this with, with Jose and, and Jesus was that every time we go to pretty much anywhere, honestly, I mean, we went to Colorado, it's like, you know, and I shared this with everybody in the company, like, you, you should go, you should go, right? Like, go to the, right? It's, but literally, like, every time we go somewhere, we're, we're almost going home. Like, there's no, like, sense of, like, oh, I'm going somewhere strange, or it's like, no, like, yeah. you're... You're in our you're in our backyard. We got you, and we do something special like horseback riding, or you know, riding bikes, or whatever. We hit the you know the game, or you know, just something cool. Or, so I think you know, number one, thank you guys. Like thank you guys, because that is like you know, I've said it before, but there's so many. I think sometimes we think like, oh, we got to go to outside of our own country to see beautiful things when we we live in a beautiful land you know that's just so diverse and it's very cool um so thank you guys i think um, one thing <clears throat> that i picked up on today was the, the the vision just got that much clearer and sharper to, today right and i think every time we do a pack meetup I, I i have this this like this revelation that it just gets that much sharper and and I don't know if you got if you all saw it but I, I think it goes back to what many of you were saying about how the agents were getting impacted right and when we actually like when you go and speak to people your friends right they're like they're they're excited about it you know and 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 I, and I think that that is fundamentally huge because the vision really is it's 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 everywhere you know there's valets that are getting their licenses and and right and then and then which was kind of cool was that what i, I forget who shared it. i think it's maybe gustavo shared it was like ignacio right um leo um um argenis asus that like they were even like hey like we're 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 we're, we're up like we're like the, we're the we're the next leaders. Like we're the future. We're the future. Like is it like this? And and I, and I that that for me was like, wow. Like I'm getting chills right now, even yeah, just thinking about that. That was. You guys there, you guys said it. I was like, that's a. That's, it's such. It's such a. It's such a beautiful. It's such a beautiful thing. Like that. So to see that get that much clearer and that much sharper to me was was just. It was just amazing. Um, you know, I think the other thing is like, and I and I talk, I share a lot, a lot of this with you guys, but like, I really do believe that you are all leaders. Like I do, I I, I genuinely believe that. And whether you think, oh, I you know, I haven't been in the business that long, or maybe I, you know, whatever, I've been in the business too long, or what, whatever, whatever that story is, you know, when you just break down fundamentally who it is that each and every one of you are. You are you are you are a leader. You're more than capable of leading, you know. And so, and and today, what what made me really happy was when I shared, because I think a lot of the people were like, oh, okay, like I'm hearing from you know certain certain 
certain people, and, and I, I literally was like, we got a hundred, we got like 40, we got a hundred more, left. we got a, a, like, we, some of you guys didn't even get to speak, you know, like, but we could have easily called you up there, and it would have been like, boom, there it is, gospel, here, you know, there, there you have it, so that right there, I just think is, is awesome, I think the other big thing that I thought, you know, that, that just came to me today was, like we just cannot think small. So guys, what, what I was gonna share though was that one thing that came to me today was like, the one thing that I think we, each and every one of us have to remember is that like we cannot think small. We cannot think small because we're on this, like, and I don't know if you guys feel it, but we're on to something really, really, really special. And the only thing that stops that or the only thing that, you know, keeps that not Names. to where it needs to be is is just us simply just thinking small. Mm -hmm. So wherever it is that you're thinking, you know, think bigger. And and I think that if we keep that in the in the back of our minds of like we got to keep thinking bigger, keep thinking bigger, keep innovating, keep making iterations, keep making adjustments, keep adding more value. Like we because because and, and as i've sh shared this many times before right there's there's nobody coming to save any of us mm. <laughs> you know what i mean and and i don't know about you guys but i've never been a part of anything like this mm. like f from a never been a part of anything like this so can't think small and i think the third thing and it just showed me today and you guys really like demonstrated this to me in your in your team like the team right here in houston was that you have we must work hard and, and you know, I, I, I think that that event does not happen because I, I think that it was just so well received by the community and by just everybody in the real estate space. Like it is that we gotta put the effort in at the same time. You know, because because here's here's where I'm going with this. Because if you don't put the effort in, you had guests there today. You have guests for the day. You had guests for the day. That drove from different, you, you guys all had guests there today. You had guests there today. From San Diego, right? That, that you knew from here. Yeah. But if we don't put that effort in to reach out and to share, then really then that falls back on us as, as it's almost like, it's almost like malpractice. Kind of. When you think about it, you know? And so that was the other thing that came to me was like, you know, when I go back home, like I need to work a little hard. Like, I need, I need to be just be a little bit more intentional because, because you know, again, back to what I was sharing, the vision is clear, the the vehicle is clear, who we're doing it with is clear, the product is is, is clear, it's helping people, but it, it, it does take a little bit of that effort. And I think you guys demonstrated that so well, and I just think the event was great, like I really do, and ev everything from, from last night's dinner to this morning to the, to even the breakfast place. Like, as, 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 as interesting as that was, you know, how quickly we were able to, to like, get in, eat, boop, and then like, be at the event by one o'clock. Like, that, that was all strategic, carefully and strategically planned. That takes work. That takes effort. And so that was, for me, was just my, those were my takeaways. Yeah. Everybody keep your heads on swivel. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, what, what part of Houston are we in right now? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, where are we? I don't know, mountains. Every time I'm taking We <laughs> run. This is yeah. Like, yeah. Renee just drove us to like five different cigars. <laughs> yeah, 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 like yeah. Closed. Yeah, yeah. Permanently closed. <laughs> <laughs> and we were driving like as the instructions were coming in. So we were approaching the place. It was like, oh, change of plans. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> we were approaching. Oh, change of plans. I'm like, damn, dude. Like, yeah. <laughs> Go like this, and everything. We can just throw uh, <laughs> sign language. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I said, Realtor? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Are you with me? High five. Yeah, let's go. Yeah. Come on, let's go. Yeah, yeah. 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 All right, so after a great pack meetup, uh, it's now Friday morning, and we're getting ready to go have some breakfast. After breakfast, we're going to be jumping on a plane back home. Uh, Houston has been just welcoming. It's been amazing. Um, we also got a workout in this morning 
which was a lot of fun with Mr. Jose Bonilla, who's right there. <laughs> Great workout and got the, uh, you know, just got the bodies kind of Got a little sweat in, which was nice. Um, so all in all, it's been a great trip, but we still got breakfast today and then the flight back. So stay with us. Thank you guys so much for watching and uh, hopefully I'll see you soon. <laughs> great. Oh, that sucks. Yeah. Throw this one. Hmm. No, I, I, I think I'm okay. I think I'm okay, yeah, yeah. thank you. So what PAC has given me is that PAC has given me the leadership skills so that for example, like the role plays, you know, where I can also host the Q&As, where I can speak to a larger audience. So it's given me the leadership skills so that I can help more agents. And thanks to PAC, I've been able to find my purpose in life. And that's to be able to be able to take more of care of my, my agents as well. Not just my agents, but any agents uh, yeah, in the, in the PAC uh, community. Not only that, but thanks to the support uh, through the leaders, I'm able to leverage my business and delegate a lot of the responsibilities. For example, I just got back from vacation and I was able to delegate uh, those responsibilities to other leaders where I knew they were taking care of my agents so they're producing um, at a higher level. And so, for example, I was just—I just came back from vacation. I was gone for three weeks, and I know that the agents were taken care of. So, that's why I love Pack Home Realty. Um, it's a company that really supports you um, and helps you. Not only that, from the leaders or the founders, but also the staff. You know, when they can teach you or they can show you how to work your tools so that you can make more money at the end of the day and grow your business. So for a new agent and also experienced agents, the value propositions that we have at Pack Home Realty are the are two most important, is training and support. You're gonna get tons of training through every day. We have at least a minimum, minimum of one training and the support from our leaders and from the staff. Uh, we show our agents on how to grow their business by um, generating new leads converting at a higher level, knowing what to say, how to say it, how to handle objections, and also how to build a community, right? And that's important for anyone who wants to start a business or grow their business in real estate. Something that I love about the company as well is that we are focused on production base. That's our main focus, is how you as an agent can grow your production. And so this is why I love Pack Home Realty. <laughs> Where is that though? So this last one was in Miami. And okay. Dude, oh. it, it, I heard it was super dope. Like the people they have there, they have celebrities. Like um, the last one they had is like J Lo was there. Like Alex wow. Rodriguez. Yeah. You know, doing a good job. Like, yeah. Yeah. That'd be really dope. That's awesome. Yeah. yeah. It's all real estate based. So yeah. Perfect. The cool part of it was that it was like, all, it was kind of, and, and I think the group like bonded and connected that much more because it was rain, you know, so we had, we had to literally like, we're picking up chairs, moving chairs, kind of re reorganizing through the event. And then the traffic that was on the street, you know, every once in a while you'd get like a, uh, like a, tr a truck that would like, you know, honk their horn or, or whatever. But it was always, it was, it was funny though, because it was always during like a good point, you know, so. It, the whole, the, it was just, it was literally like, it was magical from the venue, Gustavo, Ani, like his wife, they just, they went all, 
you know, the team. Oh, they nailed it. Uh, Carlos Portillo, yeah. Leo, yeah. Marjorie. So, I mean, just thinking back, reflecting right now on the event yesterday was crazy. I mean, the amount of agents that we have here in Houston, just in Texas, the amount of agents that are getting ready to onboard and thinking also about all of our amazing people in Arkansas, amazing people in Texas, uh, here, I'm sorry, amazing people in Colorado, uh, amazing people in South Carolina, and then, of course, all the amazing people in, in Southern California and Northern California, the Alvarados, it's like, it's just Oscar Uribe. I mean, it's just like the, the, the list is crazy. I said something yesterday for those that were at the event. I said, you know, you're getting to hear three or four speakers when the reality is, is we can, we can roll out another hundred that are just as impactful, just as knowledgeable, uh, just as professional, really. Hey everybody, just got back home. Just wanted to share, Houston, you were a blessing. You were absolutely amazing. It was a honor meeting each and every one of you, getting to spend time with all of you. To all the pack family that came in from the different states, everything from dinner the first night to horseback riding to the actual pack meetup to uh, going to the cigar lounge to breakfast even this morning, working out, just hanging out with each other. Inspire, I just want to share with you all. You, you guys have inspired me so much. I learned so much from each and every one of you. Let's keep um, uh, let's keep building. Let's keep building the business of our dreams and naturally. You know, I foresee PAC just being an absolute leader in the industry uh, of real estate, helping agents all over the country sell more real estate, uh, ultimately being able to empower people to build the business of their dreams from anywhere. So uh, thank you guys so much and tune in for our next episode. Also, with that being said, Houston, we'll see you soon. <laughs> we'll be back.